our Father who art in heaven, the Son, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Forgive us our debt as we forgive those who debt for against us. <laughs> as we forgive our debtors. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amon Re. Amen, Amon. Jupiter Zeus, to whom we pray. Radiance. Ratio. Radius. Radiation. Uranus. Uranus. Of the annual year. Good morning, November the 14th. What's the temp? Let's check the temp. Temperature. What is it? 32, <laughs> freezing. 32, the number value of EVE. Evening. Where's this crazy book called the Bible? With its binding spine, the yoking yoke of yoga, the oxen joined the two who are one. Kings. Kings. There is no greater love. From Gene Ammons and Sonny Stick. Kings. Recording this book. Boss Tenors, straight ahead from Chicago, 1961. It was recorded in 1961 and released under Verve Records. Verve. Sonny Stick was on the alto sax, Gene Ammons on the tenor. Verve. Buster Williams played the bass, Verve. John Houston on piano, and George Brown on the Amber, bass. Amber. Before that, we heard the Buddy Rich Big Band with November the 14th. And Mercy, Mercy. Wednesday, Wednesday, which is Woden's Day. Woden is the Norse version of the Norse version or the North Thorn North version. Norse version of Saturdays from 5 a.m. to 9 a.m. This is WHRB Cambridge, streaming on the web at whrb.org. The Norse version of Mercury in Latin, Hermes in Greek, and Toth in Egyptian, which is where we get the occult science. The moon is waxing. Up next, Luna, the Luna. From John Coltrane. This tune, Equinox. John Coltrane, Coltrane Equinox. Sound. That album was released by Rhino Equal in 1960. Night. And we'll hear John Coltrane playing the sax. So the moon Steve is. Steve Davis on bass, Elvin Jones on drums, and McCoy Tyner on piano. McCoy Tyner After on that, piano. We might hear a little Johnny Hodges and Wild Bill Davis. I think we'll hear the tracks Sophisticated Lady and It's Only a Paper Moon. Hmm. Only a Paper Moon. <laughs> wow. The 14th, 1114, originally 914. Novum is 9 in Latin. Octo October, octagon 8, septum 7. December coming up, the death of the sun, December 10, say 10, Satan equals 55 in Gematria, 5 and 5, 10, say 10, say death at the Tropic of Capricorn, why do you think Santa, Santa, which is Satan anagrammatic, Santa's also 55, uh, so it's the same letters, S is 19, A is 1, N is 14, T is 20, and A is 1, adding to 55, 1955, Back to the Future, the 55, 1955, double die penny. So why does Santa have, Santa originally had someone with him. It wasn't just Santa, it was Santa and Krampus. Krampus was for the bad kids, with his coal to put in the stocking. The coal, the embers, the ambers, the fire, the dying light, burr, ember. Amber, everything turns tan, say tan, all brown and orange, amber, hued. So the moon is waxing, 
The lights are coming back and we'll be full. She's gonna be full. Her full face will be visible. There. Right, where is it? The 23rd, right after Thanksgiving, which is the 22nd this year. This is where they took out Kennedy at high noon in Dallas at Dealey Dale Plaza, site of the first Masonic, Freemasonic temple in Dallas, and the where they changed the motorcade route to go up on Elm Street, Nightmare on Elm, Elm Street of the Elites, the Elites. It's, if you look at the above, the uh, overhead image of Dealey Plaza, those two lanes going in, under, going to go under the triple overpass, guess what? It forms a pyramid, a truncated pyramid. Yep, it does. It's this. It's their sign which they put right in front of you here in this occultocracy, these Elites. This was put on here in 1933 when they got the complete control of the United States of America. The Federal Reserve, which is a banking cartel which owns the federal government. It's just as federal as Federal Express. 1913 Federal Reserve Act it gave them, then we went into World War I, which they wanted and then we got what after that? There's L, number 12. L is the, t the 12th letter, the Lamed and the Lambda. Lamed in Phoenician, Hebrew, Lambda in Greek. Number 12 in the alphabetical order, the phonetic of the Phoenician bull god, L, of Can Canaanite, the Canaanites and the Phoenicians. And do you see how these? this is a depiction of an entity here, the eyes? This is wealth, mammon, Hades, Pluto. This is an awful joke here that they have in God We Trust because Jesus, Jupiter, Zeus, the Savior, Serpentine, Jesus, Joshua, the Josher, the Joker, the Jester, the Traveling Fool, the Sun on the Ecliptic, God's Son, who was about to die on the Southern Cross. What did he say? You cannot serve two masters. You cannot serve God and mammon at the same time. You can't serve, you can't serve God and money. So this is a this is an evil joke on all of us. They want us serving this mammon, and wealth. They want you thinking this green god is the good one. You know, obviously it's not. This is petrodollars. Nixon took the nation off the gold standard and made the back deal, back backdoor deal with the Saudis to put all make all oil traded with dollars. This is oil, the oil well, which is dirty and destroying Mother Earth. This is the false green god in which the masses are trained to trust through the educational system and through everything, everything. What is the forbidden fruit in the Garden of Eden? The tree, it's for the fruit from the tree of knowledge of good and evil, right? So we're, we're in the east of Eden, Adam's put in the east where the house, it's the house of the rising sun. Where the sun is on the ecliptic at the spring equinox of March, Aries, arise. Right now, the sun in the northern hemisphere is going into his, going right toward his death. In a little more than a month, he'll be here at the lowest point. He's not at his lowest point yet. The nights have not completely overtaken the day yet, but that will happen here. Right? And what is this path of the great circle of the year, the ecliptic? It's a serpent sine wave or a sin wave. Original sin, it's a six wave. God created everything in six days and then rested on the seventh, right? And the Jewish religion has the Sabbath, the sixth day, Saturn's day. They put his rest day on the sixth day. Huh, why is that? And why was there a breakaway religion called Christianity? And why is the, are the books of these so-called Christians put together with the books of the Jews when they're uh, diametrically opposed? One recognizes that the day of rest is Sun's day and that this God has to do with the Sun, God's Sun, and one says that this God is Saturn, Saturn's day and Sun's day. The only two that begin with S of the seven days, by the way. So this God is linking itself to seven right away in Genesis. 
And what is seven all about? Everything. Seven. S E V E N. Even, evil, even, evil, everything. On and off of Adon, Atom, and Eve. See, this is Hermetic science. Before, before there was Judaism, before there was Christianity or Churchianity, guess what? There was Hermetic science. There was the sun and the moon and the seven of astrology, the seven deities, right? So, like that XTC song with Dear God, Did you make mankind after he made you, dear God? Because the if there is a real God, right, which I have a sense of through, you know, synchronicity and all this kind of other stuff, and just intelligence, you know, just the mind, just consciousness, the, the psyche. That shows me there is something more than all the meat and potatoes, the nuts and the bolts, right? And I don't buy at all that we're just bodies and that all of our, that our consciousness is just a product of this meat here. Like, you know, go to any any neuroscientist and say to, to that neuroscientist, where am I in here? Can you show me where I am? When They can stimulate your memory and parts of your you know, personality with electrodes and all this kind of stuff, but they can't find you in there. They'll say, no, you're not in there, because you're not. And your memory isn't necessarily in there either. Right? You get the psyche, the, the psyche by definition is the human soul. And we get all these psychiatrists treating people like meat, not like souls, not like light, consciousness, awareness. So Eden's in the east, east that where they the tree eat from that Eve eats, and Adam eats. Eve would be your psyche. Eve, psyche, the maiden. Adam would be the body. The serpent would be the sine wave, going from one to the other. And what if though you look at this as your whole brain, right? If this is your brain, if this tree. Your brain tree with its branches, its dendrites. Dendrites are the branches of the tree. Dendrite in its etymology is tree. The brain tree. Here in Massachusetts and in England we have brain tree, a, a, a town. So this would be your right hemisphere and this would be your left. And this would be your corpus callosum and your spine. Right? So when they get evicted, evicted for eating from the tree of knowledge, which is the left brain of critical thinking of cunning, the serpent is cunning and subtle, all having to do with intelligence at the left hemisphere, the L left hemisphere, the sinister side, right, the fire side, the male side, the yang, Adam, and the Eve even, right? The carnal mind, the left brain. So we get kicked out of the right brain into oblivion <laughs> and into what is what we have now. There is a there was a fall, no question. Humanity is in a fallen state. Believing you gotta pay to live. You know, believing in that belief is a way to live instead of, you know, merging your belief and your intuition. Intuition is all in the right hemisphere of the ice of Isis. This is the other thing. People think hell of the heel is in the, uh, a fire, fiery pit. Uh, this is what, what they've been conditioned to believe. It's ice. It's ice cold. It's a fiery, icy pit. <laughs> it's so cold that it's like extreme heat, which is just painful, right? Remember that part in Back to the Future where, where, uh, where uh, Einstein comes back in the car, the dog, after the first uh, time travel test, and Doc goes to open the door, and he goes, ah, ah, and Marty goes, what, is it hot? And Doc says, no, cold, damn cold. The icy pit of winter. This is the winter, the inter, the dark time, Capricorn. And also, you remember in the Garden of Eden, when we read from there, there's four sections. In this garden of eating of 18, 3, 6, 9, 18, the V, the Valley of Eve, the serpent. The serpent, which is always linked up with the primordial mother goddess. Always. So they're about to be evicted from 
the garden where we were at the den of Eve. We'll go into that next. Hare Krishna.